Good morning, good morning. It's barely morning. It's a little after 11 on my first break. Out trying to get a few steps in. Mr. Willie's not with me. But uh, I am committed to Debbie and committed to you guys. So, got to get a few steps in. It's a little chilly, chillier than I expected, but uh, it's good. I don't do a full block on my short breaks, but I'm gonna do one at lunch. And that's what I've been doing. It's just getting in when I can. Plus yesterday, get this, I did some Pilates on YouTube. It was tough. You look at Pilates and think, oh, it's easy. Not for plus size people, <laughs> but I'm getting there. I'm getting there. It feels too good being down these few pounds. I just keep imagining, God, how can it be if I lose 50? So, getting back, getting back little by little, baby steps. So, as always, thank you for watching. Always remember, never forget, we love you. Peace out. Hello, it's me again. All right. And look who's with me this time. Hey. <laughs> lunchtime walk. It is lunchtime. Typical and southern weather. It's, it's in the 60s today after being in the 80s this time last week. Yeah. Yes. It's, it's a little chilly. It's going to be summertime in a minute. I put on a jacket, a little hoodie this time because I went out this morning and I was cold. When I was talking to you guys, I was cold. 50, it was 54 degrees. I know, I know. You're you're in Wisconsin where it's 20 degrees. I know, I know. But 54 and the wind blowing and, and humid here is kind of uncomfortable. I was cold. But... Uh, Got a little jacket on now and uh, getting, getting moving. Yeah, we gotta, I, I had to get back to the house and finally, well, continue to put the desk that was not complete away and get it back to um, Amazon or whomever it's going back to. <laughs> Problem is that it's heavy and I can't find a box for it that really fits, so it's I don't really want to work on it, but I got to get it out of, out of the been, office. He's been procrastinating on that thing. I wanted to just throw it out. I just wanted to take the whole thing and throw it out, throw it in the trash. That's what I really wanted. <laughs> but to then do. he'd have to pay for two deaths. It's almost worth it, kind of, sort of. <laughs> okay. It's almost kind of worth it. Just think, okay, so it's going to cost me a little money to throw it away? All right, fine. Uh, but I won't allow it. Because then you got to pick it up. It weighs 170 pounds. You got to get rid of it either way. So, and I keep asking them, do you want I mean, me to help? I mean, you got, I mean, I mean, you got to tote it to the UPS place and, and on and on and on. It would have been great if they had just sent the, the thing and one tore up in the first place. The first and time. That would have been the best thing. Now I have to do something. No, I don't want to do Pay for it and do something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'd pay for it and got to do something. So, so we'll see. We'll see. Uh, it, it, it won't get done today, but it'll get done by the end of the week, hopefully. So, there you go. I'm not going to stress myself out about it. That's, that is for sure. And it doesn't help to have a wife who is always asking him to do stuff. I'm not going to stress myself out about it. <laughs> I'm just not. Let's go walk. Let's do this. Let's do that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was... Anyway, so I'm not being nagging. So we, I'm not being nagging. We appreciate all the people who have watched the last two uh, two long form videos. Um, there's a bunch of y'all. We appreciate. You. Oh, excuse me. 
you, you saw God to signal. <laughs> I didn't put my brake lights yeah, on. Yeah, you had to signal before you do that. Um, <laughs> but um, those of you who watched the too long, the long form video, we appreciate all, yes, all we of do. people. And there's lots of y'all. Lots of y'all. And we appreciate we it. We got 32 likes on that last one. So if you would, so I'm very those thankful. Of you, if you would watch it, if you would share it with your friends, because it's like food. Food that you like, you share with your friends. You don't keep to yourself. So we appreciate you doing we appreciate you doing just that. Yes. All right, I, I, I just wanted to get that out there. Good? You want to turn around? Or? No, yeah, sure. But, uh, I think you got to get back into Yeah, I got to make meals today and uh, get back to work at some point. So. Yeah, yeah, that's good. <laughs> that's but good. again, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. subscribe. And share with please, other people. Please share with other folks because we don't have any other way of, of, of getting videos out to people unless you people who watch, you know, share with your friends. Uh, if you, that you come across something that you that you find interesting or entertaining or helpful. In that some all way, helps, our, cha helps um, our channel. That helps us. So we appreciate that. So thank you so much. Always remember. Never forget. We love, love you, you. And there's, there's nothing, nothing you can, can do, do about, about it. it. Peace. Peace. Ooh. Hello, just here to say good morning and it's a hump day. Happy hump day. It's Wednesday. Out for a little stroll on my first morning break. The sun is sunning. Still a little chilly, but it's nice out. Hubby is inside, so I'm getting my first few steps in alone today, but it's all good. Not really alone. Got the Lord with me. Thank you for watching. Love you. Well, hello there. It's been a while since I did a grocery haul so thought that I would include this in this week's vlog and say hello and thank you for watching um, please like comment and subscribe to any of our videos and share them because there there's always someone out there can be blessed by some of the things that we do and say and that's our ultimate goal here at Deb's life is to be a blessing and should be a reflection of Christ. We are Christians here and we want to reflect the life that Christ has given us. So now enough ministering and I'm gonna take you in on, this is a Saturday haul and um, it's a Walmart pickup. All of these were uh, two, a little over $200 worth of groceries for the week. So let's turn around and see what we have. Okay. And there you have it. We're going to start over here in the bread section. And we have here some flat, flat out. Let's see if I can get it to where you can see it. Flat out light original flatbread. Um, I figured because I don't care for regular bread like this because it just gets to be too much for me. Um, and so I do these. We're gonna try these out, and they're low carb, more protein than anything else, and then and, and it should be. Uh, and they're low points because I do follow the Weight Watchers plan here. And I'm going to sit down one day and go over, do something like a, what I eat in a day. And I'm down, like I said, uh, like 20 pounds. I, I'm focusing more on my inches and how I feel this time around in Weight Watchers because this is the last go round. <laughs> Debbie's going to do something and, and never leave Weight Watchers. I got to do it. And I'm not going to do it with drugs. I'm going to do it with Jesus Christ and, and eating better. So, now for that. Here we go. 
We have um, English Ezekiel bread, English muffins. I normally get the Thomas's, but I decided I would go a different route and see how me and hubby like these for breakfast. We have these usually with uh, some sunny side up eggs. Maybe one morning I'll show you that. And we're back due to technical difficulties. I had to start over again. But we were talking about the flatbread here. Um, and then we have the Ezekiel bread. It's uh, sprouted bread. It's not, uh, doesn't have gluten in it. But um, I've never tried these, so I'm going to give a review on them when we do try them. We eat that again with our sunny side up eggs in the morning. Down here we have the regular bread for everybody else in the house. The honey wheat, Sara Lee, and the artisanal bread <laughs> for them. That back over there. Back here we have our uh, cosmic apples. Those are some very yummy apples. If you have not tried the cosmic, they are a little pricey, but they are worth it. You never get a bad apple. Never have I gotten a bad apple out of this. They're always sweet, crispy, and they're best eaten in from the refrigerator, ice cold. They're very yummy. Then we have some carrot chips that for salad and for hubby's snack in his lunch. And then we have some grapes here, some seedless grapes that are very sweet and good. What else we got back here? Here we go, we have some garbanzo beans that I like to put in my salads that I make. Pasta salads or even regular salads. Garbanzo beans are good in there. Good source of protein. And something different that I tried last week, I bought some hearts of palm. If you've never tried these, they're mainly, if you eat them with salads or I slice them up and put them in my pasta salads. But I tried something different this week and just ate them as a snack. I had two of them as a snack and on Weight Watchers, there's zero points and they were yummy. They just, it's a different kind of taste. I, I can't really explain it. It's like a, a, if you had a pickled carrot or something like that, it's, it's sort of like that. Then we have some hard-boiled eggs. Yes, I buy hard-boiled eggs because they are boiled to perfection. Sometimes I boil some and sometimes I get these and it's easier to make uh, tuna salad and chicken salad regular eggs here. Back here we have a supply of meatballs because I'm going to figure out some kind of recipe with meatballs this week. It's probably, it's not going to be meatball and spaghettis, but it'll be meatballs and something seasoned up. Back there we have some popcorn, which we have at night for snacks. Some Orville Redenbacher. Then we have some mozzarella cheese. Back up here we have American cheese for sandwiches. Um, some Brickstone sour cream at my son's request because I don't eat sour cream. I love sour cream, don't get me wrong, but sour cream does not love me. <laughs> Even if I take the lactate pills, those sour cream just don't like me. And I will just leave it alone so I can stay out of the bathroom. TMI. <laughs> but then we have the Starkiss tuna in olive oil. I tried this a couple of weeks ago and it's very tasty. You, ha you can't eat as much as you do with regular tuna in water, but it's very flavorful. So um, it's a different twist on tuna. And then we have light string cheese for snacks and for hubby's lunch. Here we have some imitation crab, the seafood snackers. I had these last week for snacks 
along with the hearts of palm and it was very yummy i just dump them in the same bowl and just eat that and squeeze a little lemon juice in there yummy these the whole pack of this is only two points on weight watchers so it's a very good snack to have and they're only a dollar at uh, Walmart a dollar a piece so it's not only a bargain but it's healthy for you then we have some uh, breaded fish sticks they're not fish sticks they're fillets and I put them in the air fryer and they're just something different to have for lunch or dinner you can you can chop these up and um and put them in the wraps with some lettuce tomato and it's kind of like a sandwich somewhat in the wraps or you can put it on top of some lettuce for a salad <laughs> and then we have some chicken wings back here snacks son needless to say then we have some <laughs> zucchini blend um, hubby went and picked up some fresh zucchini for us at the fruit and vegetable stand and um, we ate those last night with some of the peppers and sauteed and stuff. It was so yummy. But I bought some blended right there, frozen. Got some carrot, frozen carrots, some triscuits, and an oldie that we, somebody mentioned we were watching on TV and they mentioned about pimento cheese. And I haven't had this since I was a child. So I bought some pimento cheese and we can have it with some triscuits. But um I don't know. I got I gotta get that taste back and see. It was Dorcas on uh All Things Dorcas, her YouTube channel. And she mentioned um she hadn't had any in a while. And I thought, me either. I'm gonna get some. <laughs> and then we have here um some cubes. These are Nor Chicken Bouillon cubes that I put in uh, for seasoning. You can use it for seasoning and different things other than salt. Um, yellow rice, of course, that's the hubby's favorite. Come up here, we have Scott Paper Towels. The only brand that I buy is Scott because they last long and they work well. <laughs> Then we have water. Then we have some flavored water down here. We have some burritos. My son bought those as a request. <laughs> and we have graham crackers. We have large, large, large lawn chicken, uh, chicken, lawn, <laughs> lawn leaf bags. Because it's that time of year, folks, to do our yard. And we supply the bags for whoever does it. But um, our yard man's going to tackle that this week. And this may be enough bags, but I doubt it. <laughs> Back here, we have some Normandy Plin vegetables for stir fries. And then down here, I was about out of wish to sh 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 wash your sister sauce. Wish the stir, you know, you can see it. I had to restock that in the pantry, and then we have chicken dip. We have the Jihu stir fry. This is when you see me doing my stir fry, and you guys ask, this is what I put in, put it in there, and it's very tasty. It doesn't have that that artificial taste. Of uh, some of his things, some of his uh, seasonings, I don't care for because it tastes fake. But this this one is good. It's very good, and I uh, keep that on hand because I mix it up. I put it on um, chicken. I put it on stir fry. I put it on um, fish, like when I do salmon, because I did some salmon last night, and um, that's what I put on there. We have the Homestyle Ranch Dressing. This is the best dressing here, the ranch dressing. Um, but Hidden Valley, it has an artificial taste to me as well. This tastes like you made it at home. Um, I make my own dressing sometimes, 
but this tastes just like you make it from home and it has a lot of the vegetable chunks and you can taste the fresh vegetables in it and I know that other people are liking it now because I can rarely find it at Walmart Publix is probably the only place I regular find it and they had it at Walmart today so I had to get it and then we have our regular regular fig newtons that we get for snacks and for hubby's lunch so that's it for today I thank you all for coming along on this grocery haul with me please give some comments of things of suggestions you may have I hope this was helpful for some suggestions to you and we have some walking. We've been walking. I've been walking mo mostly by myself this week. I think hubby came along twice, but he walks on his own at work, he says. <laughs> I hope he didn't hear me say that. But he's going to edit this, so he'll know I said it. But uh, <laughs> he, he, he hasn't been coming with me on my walks very regularly. But I recorded my walks and um, I had to switch out phones to record this because I didn't get many of my walks because my phone is so full of recordings, it's got to be cleaned up. So it won't let me be great, <laughs> but um, we're fixing that right now. But right now I'm using hubby's phone, so if it looks different and you like it better, let me know because he says his phone has a better camera than mine so once again thank you for watching and never forget we love you and there's nothing you can do about it happy saturday